Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to install Chocolate Doom on your PS Vita. So if you guys don't know what that is, basically it's some software that lets you play all the classic Doom games, and the Hexen games, and pretty much all of the games like that. So if you guys are interested, all you want to do is just go ahead and open up Vita Shell. I will be using the USB connection in this video, so all you want to do is just press select, connect your PS Vita to your PC, and I will show you guys what to do next. Right guys, so once you're over on your PC, I will leave a link to Chocolate Doom in the description. And as you can see, it was last updated in April, so it's fairly new um, for a PS Vita homebrew. But anyway, what you want to do is just scroll down until you get to the installation guide section. And what you want to do, you want to click VPK and then data.zip. And then that's just going to start downloading the Chocolate Doom VPK and then the data file. So also, um, here are some launcher controls. You guys can just take a look at these if you want to. Um, there's also a supported games list right here. So sort of um, the games that come in this are actually in the WAD format. So they're called iWADs. And these are all the games that support it. So there's um, Doom 1, Doom, Doom 2, TNT. You guys can get these WADs from wherever you want. If you want um, a free Doom WAD right here, you can actually just download it. You just click here and you'll be able to find the download file on this web page. So this also supports um, custom WADs as well, which work with games, basically like ROM hacks. Um, they just go in the PWADs file, so you guys can get these custom files um, from Google. It's very simple, you just literally type in PWADs and you can find them. Um, it also has a supported list. Um, well, these are all the supported games, so you can get custom games for all of these games. But anyway, once you have got your files, just go to your downloads folder. As you can see, there's the data file right here, so all you're going to do is just click right right click then do extract here it's going to bring out a data folder all you want to do is just copy this across to your ps vita's uxo folder next all you want to do is get the chocolate doom and just drag it onto your ps vita that can go on the root next you just want to get a folder called iwads now go inside of your data folder go inside of chocolate and as you can see there is an iwads folder in here and if i take a look at my one these are all the games i got so i got these from the internet you guys can get them from wherever you want there is free doom which is completely free and open source and everyone is allowed to download it so i'm just going to copy these into the iwads folder so once that has finished the copy and cross, you are now done for the PC. So you can now disconnect your PS Vita and I will show you guys how to set this thing up. Right guys, so on your PS Vita, the first thing you want to do is just install the VPK. So just go onto your UXO, scroll all the way down, and then you're looking for Chocolate Doom R2.VPK. So press X to install it. Press X on yes. And then it will just start installing. So once it has finished installing, you can now close out of Vita Shell, and now you're looking for the game on your home screen. So here it is, Chocolate Doom, just press X, and then it will start up. Okay, so what it's going to do is it's going to scan your iWADS folder, and it's going to find all of the WADS that you have installed. So as you can see, it's come up with mine. I've got the original Doom, I've got Doom 2, I've got Final Doom TNT, and then I've got Heretic and Hexen. So I'm pretty sure the free Doom is this one right here, um, Doom Shareware. Um, so let's just play a game. Oh, we've got a few options at the top here. You can press left and right to navigate. So we've got video, we've got audio, input, buttons, files. Um, so this is for like save files and stuff. Um, misc, net, and then just back to game again. So let's just start a game right here. Let's go for Hexen. Never actually played this game before, but apparently it's pretty good. Alright, so as you can see, the game loads up. Let's go ahead and do a new game. Um, Fighter, Warrior. I've never played this before, but it looks pretty cool. Okay, so we're in the game now. As you can see, working perfectly fine. Um, kind of dark. I'm not quite sure why. So, how do we fight? Okay, we punch. Punch these characters. So, very much like Doom. It looks like the medieval version of Doom, I guess. It looks pretty cool, though. Okay, so let's quickly try another game. Let's go for Doom 2, I guess. This is, is another very good game. Okay, so if you guys are wondering, this does have full working sound and everything like that. And you can also save the game. Um, so let's go on New Game. Play this one.
Yeah guys, so that is pretty much it for this video. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.